Ever since I got my first iPad, I've wanted to be able to pretty much manage my entire workflow on my iPad. Whether it's building a Drupal site, maintaining a Drupal site, working in some other CMS like Joomla or WordPress, as well as I wanted to be able to manage code. That's always been a problem till now. Hi, my name's Rod Martin. This is OS Tips from OS Training. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to run Visual Studio Code on your iPad. And just to show you, here's what the setup looks like. This is my desktop. There's my 12.9 inch iPad, and I'm running Visual Studio Code right on it. How am I doing that? Well, that's the topic of this video. The secret is to run vscode.dev in your browser and it works really well on your iPad and Safari. And here it is. I can open it by just going to vscode.dev and of course I can connect any remote repository like a GitHub repository. I happen to have connected mine already. Here's the repository for some code that I have on my blog to allow people to calculate how many days they've been alive. Now I can manage it right from my iPad. Of course, there are some caveats. On an iPad, local file system is still unsupported, so it's not the full experience. As well, you may not have access to all of the extensions you typically would have access to, and you may not be able to even add them because they're blocked on the web version. But in a pinch, you can now access code for any remote repository right on your iPad. And honestly, that's really awesome news. I love using my iPad for as much as I can, and now I can edit remote repositories on GitHub or any remote repository for that matter, which means if I'm working on a Drupal website, guess what? I have full access now to the UI through my iPad. I can edit, manage, even use Layout Builder on my iPad, and now I have access to the code base as well. How awesome is that? Visual Studio Code in a browser vscode.dev. What an awesome idea. Well, thanks for joining me today. This has been OS Tips from OS Training. My name's Rod Martin. We publish a video every week. Would you like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.